I remember where to look for a gateway. Follow me. Well, you two seem to be getting on since completing your mission. Dare I hope this alliance has some staying power after all? It seems to me we share a common enemy. Kratos, you may not accept that Ragnarok is inevitable, but you're smart enough to know Odin is a threat. Whatever comes next, our best chance of surviving it is to work together. Do you agree? I do. Then as to Brock's offer, you can imagine staying under the same roof as a couple former enemies? No further temptations towards terrible vengeance? Not against you. Either of you. You have my word. This lock is different from others you might know. You'll need an enchantment on your chisel to use it. Runa. Go ahead, carve the letter. Sula. It's an incantation. Su na. Elves in Flair's camp mentioned a gate like this in Alpine. Kept on about some sacred light elf sanctum out past the barrens. A trip to Alfheim? Well, we can decide at the gateway. This boat should get us there if we can clear those guys. Remember what to do? Yeah. <laughs> Fallen log in the river. It has something on it I don't recognize. We're clear. So it's true. Tears really alive? Aye. Not exactly ship shape. He sleeps in a broom closet now. But he's adjusting. How did you find him? Largely, that's down to Atreus having figured out how to access the prophecies giants reserved for their own kind. We only learned of it ourselves after Thor and Odin came calling. To your home? Is it still standing? Barely. But all the violence was seemingly just a distraction to let Odin have a private word with Atreus. Odin was alone with your son? Did he tell you what they spoke of? Yes. He said that Odin invited him to Asgard to help him find his answers. The answers he's rushing into fate in search of. That's troubling. Well, if you're ready to talk to him, the Mystic Gateway is ahead. If not, I have some unfinished business up this river I could use your help with. Or we can follow up on that elven sanctum out in Alfheim's desert. If you want to continue exploring, we'll need to remove that log in the river. What is this? The crest of Skirnir. Never quite as smart as he thought. Good. We can explore the river now. And hopefully right some old wrongs. your unfinished business i left something behind near the falls your wedding site now why do you want to be going back there to be free of the bonds of my marriage and to asgard 
I think you severed that a long time ago. Not completely. Not enough. Guide us. My people settled this river many ages ago. Thousands traveled it on pilgrimage to the Shrine of Worship. But then the Aesir came. This is all that's left. Reavers, of course. Brother, I had a thought. What if we took a stealthy approach to our next battle? No. Patience is pious. What is wrong? Please, leave me to my prayers. I await Freya, the great healer. I am here. She will cure me. I have been a loyal follower. She would not abandon me. <coughs> I am, Freya. What do you need? Only she can cure my sickness. Mangle, Meyer, and Poem. We must help her. She demands a cure. She is dead. She is trapped here. Ignorant of her own death. If we bring her what she needs, she'll move on. You're certain. I'm not going to do nothing. She needs man, gold, mire, and palm. We should find some. What did you find? As you asked. A no song. Stay alert. What's your night? <laughs>
you recognize her? The sickly spirit. No. There was a time I could recall the face of every one of my people, but... Sometimes I wonder if gods live too long. I once felt the same. Good. I need only one more ingredient for the cure. And then what? Then I fix things. like that word. Well, that did it. That's everything I need. Let's return to the sick spirit. You would cure the dead. I promised I would take care of my people. You do not even remember her. Nor she you. And? Let us return to the spirit. I am here. I knew you would return. Even as the doubters cursed your name. Thank you. But it's time to rest. You have earned it. Thank you, my queen. I am tired indeed. Shall we continue? Yes. belong to Odin, a peace offering from my people, and a waste of good work. Oh, 
weren't always this ravenous. Ecosystem. It's out of balance. This mentions a spell that puts trolls to sleep. And a magic relic that acts as a sort of counter spell. All is desolation. Spirit. Freya, you return. Astrid, what happened to you? To your garden? The angry ark. My life's work rotted. My monument to your glory reduced to this. I am sorry, my queen. You need never apologize to me, old friend. I swore to keep this garden in bloom until you return to live forever amongst its putrescence a just punishment. I will return, Astrid. Kratos, we purge this garden of poison. Why? The earth is a reflection of those who tend it. So long as the land is plagued, her soul will be as well. We have to destroy the totems. They're poisoning Astrid's garden. Oh, 
Glad to see that still works. <laughs> An armor piece bearing Lunda's brand. Shame it's broken. Nice bit of work otherwise. Then why leave it? You suspicious of her, brother? If the orb she seeks is important, she would not have left it behind. Ah, uh, perhaps. that explosive? Setting it off could help. Ah, maybe you can hit it from a different angle. When my garden blooms, so will my soul. Life returns to the garden. Good. Must be more. Look, the door is held shut by that counterweight. We lower it, the door will open. Can you see if there's a way inside while you're up there? Anything illuminating? Let's return to Astrid. The land. It's yes. alive again. Your garden grows again. Freya, how did you... It's okay, Astrid. It's time to move on. Thank you, goddess. I do love you. And I you. You've done a great kindness. A temporary one. The garden will die again. All things do. That is no reason not to try. Freya, something your brother said. The ace here burned him. Yes. We weren't yet at war, but relations with the Vanir and Aesir had been hostile for ages. 
Freyr got it into his head that he could improve relations by sharing our magic with them. Vanir techniques for bountiful harvests, enough to feed their whole population. Getting set on fire was the thanks he got. That's true. The Aesir were too undisciplined and impatient for the subtlety of Vanir spellcraft. So when things went wrong, they blamed their teacher. So Freya was a guest when Odin burned him? Not exactly. Odin didn't mind locking Freya up. He saw the potential of the magic and wanted to know more than how to improve crop yields. It was a mob of lesser Aesir, bitter and short-sighted, who tied him up and lit him aflame as punishment for the sabotage they imagined him guilty of. Ah, but enough of that for now. Great. Maybe you can break the chain from here as well, no? The gate's open. We can head back and get inside. Nice work. 
My friends' souls are still twisted, aren't they? Give them the freedom of death. Like more of Lunda's old armor. Nearly have the complete set now. Now, how do we get up there, I wonder? We can't. Not with those vines in the way. <laughs> Looks like that worked. <clears throat> So, what's it like, being back? Like I haven't come back at all. Everything's changed. I'm a stranger here. I know the feeling. The runic word appeared over there. See it? Mekin. We should be able to reach the wedding site. The closer we get, the more tightness grows in my chest. You're sure you want to continue? Confronting the past comes with a price. It must be done. I've lived with this pain far too long. If you can believe it. We were happy once. For a time, foolishly believed the peace would last. Perhaps that was my mistake. All I wanted was to protect my family. There is no shame in that. I failed all the same. 
Do you know why I left that night, Mimir? Only a hunch. He showed me who he really was. Odin asked me to cast a protection spell on him. The one I used on my son. But the way it drove our boy mad. I refused. He was furious. Throwing every object he could find. Destroyed the room. There was only coldness after that. I tried to make it work. No one could have lived like that, your majesty. A 
Another raven freed. Those scrawlings must be Sather nearby. Lunda's ore. Be cautious. We know not what it does. You really think she'd send us to get the bloody thing if it was going to kill us? Let's just take it back to her. Interesting. Sigil arrows won't work on this. More Sather markings. Goonhild's companions can't be that far ahead. That's another raven sent to the Tree of the Dead. Perhaps we should check up on it, hmm? Look what they've done to this place. Sigil arrows won't work on this. That's all Lunda's armor taken care of, as well as her odd little sphere. Should we return them to her?
Sigil arrows won't work on this. Learn anything? Over there. Those are the lost Sather spirits. Friends of Goonhil. They don't look very friendly anymore, do they? Let us put them to rest. It's explosive! Be careful! <laughs> Let's get moving. I think that's the last of them. Damn it. I knew these souls. I would have thought them smarter than to meddle with Sather magic. They were desperate. And now they're dead. Good riddance. You blame yourself. And? It will not lessen your pain. Let's return to Gunhil. Unless you'd like to condescend more? I do not. I wish things had gone differently, but these Sather are at rest. Stop 
We'll have to find a way through this debris. Like that work. <laughs> what did you find? What's it say, brother? Ah, I know that face. You got something for me, don't ya? Yeah. Oh, well, thank you so much. Elk has been itching to get her ball back all dang winter. It's her favorite toy. What? Now. If you could find the rest of my armor set I left out there, I'll repair it for you. Free of charge, even. Oh, I uh, actually... Any dwarf can. I just didn't think you'd get my orb for me if you knew that. Sorry, y'all. Good thing you were so cautious, brother. Quiet. He's right, Mimir. Show respect. The squeaky toy could have been the death of us all. And it nearly was. Do not laugh. That's hard not to, brother. Try. Okay. Okay. Is it done? Are they dead? It is done. Your friends are at peace. Good. And... I'm sorry. Had I been here, I would have prevented this. Do you think us lost babes, incapable of making our own choices? No, but... We made a mistake. But it was ours to make. Not yours to prevent. Even if you had been here. I... Yes, you're right. Goodbye, Gunhild. Goodbye, my goddess. Kratos. Thank you for taking the time to help my people. I helped no one. They were already dead. Oh, but you did. You put their spirits at ease, and that has eased my spirit. Well, I feel lifted. Enjoy it. It will not last. You're right. There are most certainly other corrupted sisters out in the realms. You always know how to end on a cheery note, brother. Thank you. Despite his actions at Midgard, Atreus does still care for you. I know. I raised a son, too. It may be hard to believe, but he was quite similar to Atreus at this age. He adored his father, always wanted to do right by him, and was constantly frustrated that no matter what he did, he never could seem to get his approval. He confided in me a lot, 
sought the comfort his father withheld. I wonder if your son could benefit from that too. He has befriended the other dwarf. The blue one's brother. Oh. Well, if Sindri has that covered, I suppose there's no need for me in his life anymore, is there? That is not what I meant. That was sarcasm. Look, over there. Allow me. I never thought I'd come back here. Sigil arrows won't work on this.
Reavers, of course. Sacred. Now it sits abandoned, vandalized. Hopefully, the objects I'm looking for are still here. Anything interesting, brother? The door is shut. If memory serves, we'll need to light both of those torches to open it. This is a mystic fire. Its flames are short-lived. I believe we have to light both torches at the same time.
thing you learned the runes, brother. From the ceremony. A symbol of reconciliation. We drank from the lover's chalice until we could hardly stand. I confided in him that night about wanting an apology from Freyr. Odin reassured me that he'd be the only family I'd need. And I believed him. A denouncement from my people placed during my wedding. So much about that day I wish I could change. If only I'd seen the sign. Yeah. 
Anything illuminating? the Hewley family, one of the first families ripped apart by the war. <laughs> Sigil arrows won't work on this. My circlet's here. Symbol of commitment. After the ceremony, he had a new one made every week, each more beautiful than the last. He stopped when I refused to teach him the old magic. You know, my people used to send me gifts too, so I wouldn't forget at home. But after the birth of my son, they stopped too.
can't read that from here. Let's head back and I can take a better look. I thought I'd feel peace by breaking it. But I feel nothing. Perhaps what you see cannot be found in a circlet. You may be right. isn't complete. It's missing a piece. The word is complete, but I still can't read it from here. Let's head back down. Better now? No. The pain only grows. Will I never be free of it? What more do I need to do? side of this door scare me most the most difficult battles are fought within but this battle you will not fight alone are you ready yes there it is my final tie to asgard we drove that sword into the pillar together The sword was forged for the ceremony. A symbol of our union. The deepest wounds form the strongest bonds. Bastard said it as part of our vows. I hate it when he's right. Asgard holds a part of me I can't sever. My bond to my son. To the Valkyries. That damn realm isn't just Odin's. It belongs to me, too.
The pain he caused is his. I refuse to keep holding on to it. This sword no longer holds our legacy. But it will serve as mine. A much more fitting use for it. Learn anything? I suppose it's on to the next battle now. Yes. You won an important one today. I may. Since when have you ever asked for permission? It's just... I owe you my life, such as it is. And I... I caused you so much pain. You're in a terrible situation. For that, Freya, I am truly sorry. I wanted to end that war too. I know. But I swear to do better by you nonetheless. Anything you ask, consider it done. I'm forever in your debt. I appreciate that. Even if you can't help being an obnoxious no-no. I'm afraid I'll never know how to stop doing that, your majesty.
much for that boy. You know, an arrogant man once told me you can't change the past, only how it shapes you. I think he might be right. It's been a while since I've had a confidence. Would the god of few words lend me his ear now and again? As long as I am needed. Freya being burned by the Aesir mob. Well, obviously he survived. In fact, he used the opportunity to escape. But such an affront made war inevitable. Freya certainly wasn't the same after that. At least for a while. And we'll just stop there for now. His crest. It's mine. If you don't need them, I can hold on to those fan for you. Can't believe we missed this. Uh. 